all glory to God for saving me and delivering me from the, from the spirit of sudden death. Immediately I got married after a series of miscarriages. We have to go to the hospital to find out what is the cause. When we got to the hospital, I was diagnosed of rectal, that there's a tumor in my rectum that is very big. The tumor resulted to me not be able to eat. I could not go to the to toilet. I was emaciating. There was no blood. I was having anemia. So the doctor advised that they do a colostomy diversification for me, diversion for me, which I went for it. During the colostomy diversion, a lot of people that came for it, I was in the middle. The person by my right died. The other one here died in the world. I was the only one alive. I say, God, I give you all the glory. That is not yet my time that I will not die. I will live. That I'm a, a young girl that just got married. What have I done? God saved me. Then, during, during an encounter in the night, I was sleeping. I saw our mommy in the Lord. God has made him. She came. I was in a big, deep. The pit was very deep. I was inside. People were passing. Nobody could save me. I was there. Then she was passing. She said, who is there? I said, mommy, I'm the one. Please help me. She now stretched forth her hand like this. Her hand became very long with a very big stick like this. She now reached out to me inside the hole. She brought me out. Brethren, to the glory of God, I became fine. My strength returned. I give God all the glory. I was discharged throughout my chemotherapy. I did seven, six chemotherapy. Everything went well. There was no issue. The devil came again and the doctor said I should go for radiotherapy. I said I will never go for radiotherapy. The money we have spent, we have sold anything, nothing to sell again for me to go for chemotherapy. God, please help me. I will not go. God, deliver me. So, when the midnight prayer came, I followed from day one. I started praying, following. I did not sleep. Every midnight, I will be awake, even when others are sleeping. I said, I will not sleep. God, you must settle my case. I will not carry this case to 2024 again. Enough is enough. So, after that, on 1st of this um, month, that is January 1st, my new year, on New Year Day, I was washing midnight prayer live on my bed. And my case, my name was mentioned. I said, God, you have remembered me. Papa said, Selina, I bring you out. That arrow of sudden death, I take it, I break it, I destroy it. That shame and reproach is taken out of your life. This year is your year. I shouted amen. People started calling. Um, the ICT, I sent you. People started me. calling. People started calling. Give her the mic. Started calling you that they saw your, heard your name. Yes, Selena. I say yes, it's my name. I'm the one that the call. There's no other Selena. I am the one. I said it's me, it's me. I started shouting. In that night, I went to sleep. When I slept, that is the next day on second. I I saw that I was selling. People were passing. Ladies, they were passing. I said. Buy head gear, cover your head. You cannot carry your head like this. Cover your daddy came and buy one from me. And he said, Young lady, come here. And I went. And he said, There is two demons in your head. He said, I command that demon to leave you now. You will not die. This year is your year. And after that, oh, glory be to God. After that, when he made that brutal uh, declaration, I now woke up. When I woke up, the tumor that was in my rectum that have been treating for three years, that have, it still remained the same size and refused to go down. The tumor busted and 
Immediately the tumor busted. There's something in my stomach. Like somebody was turning salmon in my stomach. God was reconstructing all my organs in my stomach. I said, God, this can only be God. The tumor busted. The tumor did not just bust. Everything came out. Something that cannot use my anus for three years now. All the tumor that busted. Everything started coming out. Blood, black, uh, pus, and water. Everything came out, and I stood up from that day till eternity. I can now dance. I can now walk. I cannot sit. That declaration was on the New Year Day, breaking into the 2nd of January. And that tumor busted on 2nd of January, the exact following day. Okay, let's hear the declaration. Maybe repeat it again. I sit it can start from the beginning. Jesus. Start, start from, from the beginning. The chain of stagnation, backwardness. Break right now in the name of Jesus. That migraine that is affecting the eyes, I command it healed right now. That affliction on the right, left hand side of the neck, I command it healed right now. Selena, God is healing you. I don't know whether it's an abdominal condition, but God is also visiting you. Abdominal and condition. Your story and removing your reproach, taking away the shame. In the name of Jesus, Selena, Selena, that's the name. I take authority over the arrow of sudden death. I retrieve that arrow, return it back to hell. In the name of Jesus, and the Lord is showing me an enemy trap and a snare. This this early January that God is setting on fire right now. Every snare and every trap the devil has prepared for you and your loved ones. I declare them set on fire.
tonight I don't know if you are disposed let's go on our knees and appreciate the Lord father we want to thank you father we are in appreciation of you father we are amazed at your goodness who are we that you are so mindful of us father we thank you father we magnify you we are overwhelmed by your kindness. We are overwhelmed by your mercies. We are overwhelmed by your tender compassion. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Thank you for this.